is Ronit Mukherjee and I'm an Applications Engineer with Go Engineer. In this quick tip video, I'm going to show you how to apply remote mass to your design. We will talk about some remote mass options and SOLIDWORKS simulations as well. In this example, we are running a frequency analysis on an engine frame. This engine frame supports a heavy engine block that goes on top of it. In this particular case, we are not concerned about the engine, but the idea is to analyze the frame to determine if there are any resonant frequencies within the speed range of the engine. In order to treat the engine block as a remote mass, first we will expand parts from the feature manager design tree. Here we will find the part or the subassembly representing our engine block. Once we've found this, we can right click on the subassembly and select Treat as Remote Mass. In the Treat as Remote Mass window, the first section should automatically be filled as the engine block the user chose to treat as Remote Mass. In the next section, we will select the four inside faces of the holes where the mass is supposed to be resting. The user will also notice a split tab. This can be used when the user wants to split the remote mass into sections. All that is required is a sketch of where the user wants their design to be split, and in this case where the user wants the engine to be split. Once setting all parameters as desired and clicking the green check, the user will notice that the engine design goes into a hidden lines removed display. This means your remote load has been applied. The user can continue with their simulation and get the resonant frequencies and mode shapes as desired. I hope you found this video informative. Have a good day.